What's up guys? So I want to take a moment to discuss what this channel is going to be about and what I'm bringing to the table and why you might want to watch, you know, my content over any of the other hundreds of poker theory channels on YouTube right now. So the first thing is I have access to a very comprehensive proprietary data set of poker solver solutions. So if you look, I have every single single raised pot scenario. Um, I have every single three bet pot and four bet pot scenario. And I've used a very large game tree. So if you go on training sites or you even go on a lot of these sites where you can try to buy these solver solutions, uh, they'll usually only have two bet sizes or three bet sizes, but I've basically included every significant bet size in my solution and those bet sizes extend to every single street. So I have four bet sizes on the flop, I have four bet sizes on the turn, and I have four, SPR is too low right now, I have uh, four, four bet sizes on the river. So I have four bet sizes on every street. What does it take to run simulations with this level of granularity? Uh, essentially a supercomputer. So I've rented out a computer that has about 128 gigabytes of RAM. It has a 16 core processor and about four gigahertz of computing power. It's a very, very powerful computer. Now I have run simulations on every single board of the 184 flop subset from Pio, and it's weighted to represent the entire EV distribution of the game. So what I have here is essentially an entire solution to the game of No Limit Hold'em. I have run every single board from the 184 flop set. I've run it for every single position in six max no limit hold'em. And on this channel, I'm going to be leveraging my background as a data scientist to then analyze all of this data and try to package it into neat digestible strategic insights for you. So what are some insights that I've gained from my very large data set? So one thing is that if you look at boards that are favorable when you are playing a single race pot in position, if you're playing as the cutoff versus the big blind, your highest range bet frequency boards are going to be high, medium, low boards. If you are in the button versus the big blind, your highest frequency range bet boards are going to be triple medium boards. Now, what's happening right now is a lot of people are using range bet strategies for all their single race pot positions and high, high, low boards and high, medium, low boards. They're actually misapplying GTO strategies because they don't have a large enough sample size and they're studying one or two boards and then they're over generalizing and over abstracting their insights. That's not what's going to happen on this channel. On this channel, we're going to try to be as scientific and as precise as possible. We're not going to make assumptions from studying one board texture. We're, if we study a certain board texture, we're gonna make sure that we cover every board of that specific texture. We're going to analyze how the solver's playing its range for every single board of that certain classification. And in future videos, I'll go more into detail over the system I've developed to classify boards. Once I explain this system, you are going to find reasoning about strategies on certain board textures unbelievably effortless. Now, I have not personally found content that I think will bring this much value to the table for free on YouTube. There's maybe three or four channels that I think will be able to offer what I'm offering, but I hope to be the best at this and I hope to give you the very, very, very best poker theory content on all of YouTube. Thanks guys, have an awesome day.